Travis Vines had a pacemaker implanted in his brain two weeks ago. The operation took more than four hours. Travis was hospitalized for 10 days. It was an expensive operation, almost $12,000, but contributions from area residents came to $5,000, and their insurance company helped pay some of the cost. Travis's mother feels the early results are better than expected. The first improvement we noticed was how relaxed he seemed to be. Then we noticed uh, his speech improved, and his gait has improved some. He can now walk flat-footed with assistance, whereas before he tiptoed. So um, those those three things are the biggest improvements, and the doctor told us in about a year's time we would even see more. Travis was born with cerebral palsy, and it was through a magazine article that the family first learned of the pacemaker operation. When we first filmed young Travis a few weeks ago, he could barely walk. When he played in his backyard, someone had to help him get on his swing set. Now he can move about and plays unassisted. His sense of balance has been partially corrected, and he no longer falls down or walks into things. Vines recommends the operation to any child afflicted with cerebral palsy, even though it is still considered by some experimental. It will be another year before Travis is full capability, but his parents are confident that the operation was a success worth every penny. In Fairhope, Alabama, this is 